In response to North Korea's missile launch, the South Korean and U.S. military conducted a joint exercise to strike at the heart of the North Korean leadership. President Moon Jae-in ordered the combined artillery drill, saying that announcing a statement can only do so much to stop North Korean provocations. Two ballistic missiles blaze up to the sky, one after another. One is South Korea's Hyunmu 2 a ballistic missile system, and the other is the 8th U.S. Army's Army Tactical Missile System. The Joint Chiefs of Staff announced that the ROK and U.S. military conducted a combined ballistic missile exercise along the East Coast this morning. The Hyunmu 2 a is a ballistic missile with a range of 300 kilometers developed by South Korean technology. Recently, President Moon Jae-in had personally attended the test launch of the Hyunmu 2C ballistic missile with an extended range of 800 kilometers. The Joint Chiefs of Staff announced that the South Korean and American ballistic missiles accurately hit the target, and it has been confirmed that the missiles are capable of precisely striking the heart of the North Korean leadership in case of crisis. The latest military exercise took place at the order of President Moon. When North Korea made provocations with an ICBM launch, the South Korean president ordered his national security chief, Chung Yi yong to carry out a combined ROK-U.S. missile exercise. Chung then called U.S. National Security Advisor Herbert McMaster last night and obtained President Donald Trump's approval. According to Chung Wa-dae, President Moon said that issuing statements is not enough to deal with North Korea's serious provocation and the strong combined missile response system of South Korea and the United States needed to be demonstrated to the Pyongyang regime.